Hey everybody, welcome back to One Minute Walking Tours. Thank you for tuning in. And I say thank you because this was a hard spot to get to. <laughs> and there's really not much to see, is there? It's actually an empty lot right now. Uh, they're building a museum here, and I'll get to that in a second. You can see that's 14th Street in Manhattan. There's the Empire State Building. But we are on the corners, right up here, of West and Collier's Street. Not Collier, but C-L-A, whatever. I'm not a speller. I'm a lover. At any rate, this was the site in the Webb and Bell Ironworks, where in three months, in 1862, the Ironworks built one of the most important warships ever built, the USS Monitor. It was built in three months, launched and went down and fought the Battle of Hampton, Ro Hampton Roads against the USS Merrimack or the CSA of Virginia, depending on how you want to look at it. The Monitor was not designed for the open ocean, as it had most of its uh, ship was below water. The water line had only the turret and the pilot house above water. It was designed for coast coastal waters, harbor defense, and it would be used in that capacity all the way up to the Great War, the Monitor class series of warships. Now, there's not much here now, in part because Webb and Bell only built a handful of monitors before they went out of business in 1889 and reverted to the family ironworks. That, and that closed in 1949. And most of the shipbuilding that would go on in Brooklyn actually goes down on in the Brooklyn Navy Yard. And many of the accounts of the building of the monitor will say it was built in the Brooklyn Navy Yard. But we're actually a couple miles north of the Brooklyn Navy Yard. They needed so much iron for, well, an ironclad, it was actually easier to build it here. And you're actually right on the Bushwick Canal. Can't see too much, but there's a little area of the Bushwick Inlet. So that's, there's an area of Brooklyn called Bushwick as well. Uh, and that's where the Monitor would be launched. Um, and would take its maiden voyage across to Manhattan and back. There were 32 patentable inventions on the USS Monitor, from the twin screws to the pilot house to the twin Dahlgren rotating turret. The problem with the rotating turret was once you got it rotating, they couldn't stop it. So it had to go around, fire at the Merrimack, fire at the Merrimack. Whether they won or the Merrimack won, that's up to you. I think the Monitor won, and not because I'm pro-Brooklyn. No, I'm kidding. Anyway. If you're ever down here, and I don't know why you would be in this part of Greenpoint, this is where the USS Monitor was built. Everyone stay safe, and we'll see you next time here at One Minute Walking Tours.